This is Deroku. So, what we got is a uh, AMD Athlon 6400, and then we have a uh, AMD Radeon HD 7770. We got an AMD Radeon solid state drive that is 120. And then we got two kits of one gig each of G Skill RAM. So those are pretty cool. Then, what is this power supply? <laughs> 750. Uh, but what brand is it? I don't know. <laughs> this is a 750 watt of something. Some random brand uh, power supply, just a bronze 750. So what we were trying to do is see if uh, this will actually post at all. And it posts and stuff, but the problem that I've encountered is that after installing Windows 10 and everything, it will usually give me an error, a kernel error that it didn't install um, the 32-bit Windows kernel. So I've been trying to troubleshoot it and I've reinstalled the operating system a few times. Um, and it takes a really long time and I had trouble actually getting this to accept the USB drive as a boot drive to install Windows. Um, but after a while I was able to get that to work. And then it came up with the kernel error. After that I tried installing it again and then even doing a uh, Windows repair and that didn't work um, off of the drive as well. So then I tried to switch my hard drives out, which I know Windows 10 is really specific about the hardware it's installed in. That didn't work as well and it gave me this blank screen that just wants to sit there. Then I tried installing, putting this into this machine, installing Windows and then before I actually go and set up Windows, try and turn this off and then put the AMD solid state drive back in and I end up with the same screen as if it's looking for a driver or something along that lines. So I don't know if it's just not wanting to play nice with Windows 10 or the version that I currently have on my uh, flash drive over here, but what I'm going to try doing next is actually installing the AM3 AMD Phenom 910. Yeah, this isn't, this is the 975, but this is the 910. And we're going to try putting it in the socket and just see if it actually posts, um, since I can't benchmark this right now with uh, the tools that I have, and I don't have any other copy of Windows, like Windows 7 or 8. So, let's see if we can actually get this computer to run the OS, but at least it posts and works. <laughs> well, cool. Let's check it out. Okay, so we got the CPU in there, we got the um, AM3 Phenom uh, 910 in there, so we're going to see if it posts. Um, 
sort of want to be devil's advocate and say it's not going to post, but I also like really want it to post too, at the same time. But I don't want to be too disappointed if it doesn't. But <laughs> let's just find out. Let's put that on. Put the light. And here we go. Wrong one. Oops. <laughs> okay. And... No? Try that again. I think it's gonna work. And currently, I have no internet, so I can't install a new uh, BIOS update to make sure it is compatible, unfortunately, right now. So, let's try it one more time. I might just have to postpone this and try it again later. And I'm going to try to install the newest BIOS from their website when I actually have internet. And see if we can get it to post, which would be awesome. <laughs> okay, well, have a great day.